Ah, hello. Okay, looks like it's that time of the month again. Finally. <laughs> Loot Crate. I know it's been a long time since my last Loot Crate video, and I'm really, really sorry about that. But there's been a whole massive issue with the last Loot Crates actually getting to me. But don't worry, it's all been sorted now. Panic over. But it does mean that I'm going to have to start picking up from August's crate. I know that's a bit weird to be opening an August crate in December, but June and July's crates are actually no longer in production, and I think where we last left off was May's crate, which is annoying me with the continuity a little bit, but hey-ho, best we can do for now. But on the plus side, it does mean that to catch up, there'll be a lot more Loot Crate unboxings than usual this month, open closer together. Just so I can open the remaining crates just so we can get back up to date. So basically what I'm saying is expect a whole lot of Loot Crate videos in the upcoming weeks. I hope that's okay. I was going to originally like skip the previous Loot Crates and just like open the current ones like maybe November and December's but I thought as it's leading up to Christmas it felt really appropriate to be opening like lots of crates over the festive period. Seeing as each box is like a little present to myself anyway. August at Christmas. That's weird. <laughs> So if you've never watched any of my Loot Crate unboxing videos before in the past, I'll quickly sum up what these little boxes are all about. I say little, this is quite hefty. Inside these boxes is random toys, gadgets, a t-shirt, just random fluffy things to make your inner geek happy. You get these every month, and everything inside the box is always centred around one particular theme. The theme for the August crate was Kingdom. I'm not overly sure what that would entail, to be honest. The only thing I think of when I think of Kingdom is like Super Mario. I don't know why. And when I get these boxes, I leave them completely sealed. I've not opened it, I've not peeked inside, I've not researched it, which is really, really difficult because the August was obviously four months ago and this has just been sitting there and I've wanted to open it and it's been, ah, oh, proper tantalizing. I want to see what's inside it, but I thought, no, I'm gonna wait until I'm on camera with you guys so you guys can experience everything with me for the first time. So with all that said, let's open it. This is most definitely one of the bigger boxes they've done, I think. Okay, so I'm not gonna look. Ha ha. So I'm gonna put my hand in and grab whatever I think feels the best. Let's do the t-shirt first, because Loot Crate always do at least one t-shirt every box. So for Kingdom, I'll let you guys see it first. Ready? Bloop, bloop. Is it pretty? Is it gorgeous? Wait, is that Super Mario? That's not, that's, that can't be Super Mario. That'd be hilarious if it was. That, I don't think that's Mario. Is that Zelda? I think that is. Oh, how sweet is that? That's really cute. Loot Crate are generally spot on with their t-shirts. Isn't that cool? Oh, I just realised it is Link, because look, if you go from a distance, it's Link with his little shield. <laughs> oh, I love that. Oh, you can see it up there. You see that Zelda. <laughs> Legend of Zelda. Oh, that's fantastic. I love my printed t-shirts. Okay, next. It's a rather large box. Okay, boom. Okay, so straight away we have Lord of the Rings. It's a colour change glass. Oh, how fabulous. Hold on. Some of you guys out there might remember I got a colour changing mug uh, a few months ago now. I think it might have been in the last um, Loot Crate box, actually. Um, it was Batman and I thought, this is interesting. I'd, I'd never seen one before and it was a colour changing um, heat mug. Like as soon as you put heat in, the whole, it was like a black mug and everything just appeared. And that was just fantastic to me because I had never seen anything like that and that was awesome. And this is actually very, very stunning, but I don't understand how it can be a colour changing is it colour changing? Yeah, colour changing glass. Add cold li cold liquid. That's odd. Okay, it just says add cold liquid and the colour changes. Well, we're going to be doing that right away, but before I do that, I'll just show you that. Isn't that gorgeous? So it's the writing on like the outside of the, the ring. Isn't that gorgeous? I'm loving that. But let's be honest, all I'm thinking about right now is what colour this is going to turn. <laughs> it's weird that cold makes it work, because the mugs were like heat activated. Okay, so I've got some cold water, got the glass. I would have thought the writing wouldn't appear until like you put something in it. Like hot water would have made more sense, because like when you put it in the fire, you see the letters, yeah. But hey ho, let's see what happens. Ooh, making a mess. Okie dokie, so, so far, not a lot. What am I expecting to happen? Am I going crazy? Oh wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Oh, I think it's the letters, they're going pink. <laughs> I'll be honest, I was expecting the whole glass to change, which would have been a whole lot more impressive. It's cute, and I love the glass. It's very well made, but um, I don't know. I think I was expecting more than just pink letters. Having said that, I mean, pink is awesome, but don't know. I think I'm just spoiled, to be honest, because the whole Batman mug like that really blew my mind, so. Pretty, but was expecting a little bit more. Sorry. Yeah, like, I just emptied it out, and it's starting to go, if I do that, yeah, look, look, it's not pink anymore. That's actually more impressive if I just run my finger over it, because it goes warm again. That's actually quite funny. Nah. <laughs> okay, next. Another giant box. That's weird. Oh, that's too cute. Look at that. It's adventure time. Oh, look how cute. I love how it says adult collectible, not a toy. It's a toy. Look at it. Let's open this up and see what we've got. Oh, that's cute. I have a couple friends that are going to be really jealous about this. <laughs> how cute is that? Just a little bit precious. Look. <laughs> 
Unfortunately, I don't know a huge amount about Adventure Time. What, all, all I know about Adventure Time is what some of my friends have told me because I have quite a few friends that are like avid watchers of it. But I have looked into it and I do need to start proper watching it because there's a, quite a few of the characters I want to do a makeup tutorial for. But that is pretty impressive. I can't get over the baby penguins. Look at them. <laughs> Next, I think we have, well, I think we're at the bottom, because it's got quite light now. Oh, hold on, hang on. We have something else. What have we here? Oh, it's a print, okay. So it's a Lord of the Rings print. And I would open it up, but I kind of don't want to. I think it's meant to be kind of sealed. Gorgeous artwork. It's very pretty. I'm not sure where I'm gonna put this, but hey ho. And then I think, yeah, we're at the end now. So there's not a whole massive lot in this box, you know, which is a little bit unusual. I'm not sure. This is a nice simple box to open to get back into the swing of things. But the next thing we have, as always with Loot Crate, is they have a Loot Crate pin. So there we are, August 2017's Loot Crate pin. Very pretty and very well made. I love these. It's annoying that my collection is now two of these short, which is a little bit annoying, but never mind. And of course we have the Loot Crate book, which explains everything that's in the box, as well as some other facts like centered around the theme. So yeah, just tells you everything that's in the box and a little bit of information about each piece. And the very last thing is the Loot Crate box itself usually turns inside out to become something different. So let's quickly do that. And there we go, ma'am. So if you like having your boxes on display like I do, it's a little bit nice and just having like a blank Loot Crate box. It's just something pretty, yeah. Just to add to the collection. It does actually have a shield on the back that you can cut out and have it as like separate to the actual box. But I like keeping the box like completely together. It just looks prettier like that, I think. Yeah. Be nice to store some stuff in this one actually, it's quite pretty. And yeah, so that's August 2017's Loot Crate box. It did seem a lot smaller than the Loot Crate boxes usually are. I think it's because a couple of the items were a lot bigger and probably more expensive than some of the other stuff. That's why there was say three big items as opposed to like five little ones. I am, to be honest, more of a fan when there's like loads of little things in there because there's more to open, just experience. And yeah, the theme can be more varied. But it was a nice box to kind of like get the ball rolling again, which is nice. So yeah, that's August Loot Crate box. You might not be able to get that box now for yourself, but obviously you can get the future one I think you could probably get from a couple months back so you might be able to get say October and November's boxes still That's one of the main reasons why I went through this box a little bit quicker than usual Because if there is something you really love in there obviously you might not be able to get it now But at least you guys got to see what Loot Crate does offer So if you wanted to collect Loot Crate for yourself I'll pop a link on the screen right here That link will also be in the description bar below That will take you straight to my Loot Crate page And if you pop in the code Pink Stylish, you'll get 10% off your orders which is pretty fabulous But as I always say in these Loot Crate videos you don't have to collect Loot Crate for yourself You can just come back to my videos every month and watch me unbox mine because I absolutely love doing it because it always puts a smile on my face and that makes me happy. It's just something to look forward to every month like a little bit of Christmas all year round because we already have Halloween all year round don't we? I mean this channel is Halloween central but if you did want to collect Loot Crate for yourself and open it along with me there's the link. So thank you guys so much for watching this Loot Crate video. Stay tuned for a lot more coming up. I really miss doing these. It's so much fun but yeah so until the next one. Bye guys! <laughs>